Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make a very simple bread dough that works anytime in any way you do it. So that bread dough you can use it to make the pisaladier uh, base, you can use it to make fugas and you can use it to make any sort of bread that you want to. So I have experimented with different uh, methods to make that dough easy to uh, realize. Some people think that making bread dough is difficult, but with that recipe, I can guarantee that you will always have a crunchy, flavorsome and tasty bread dough. So just follow my advices. Don't skip any steps. You will always have delicious breads, whatever shape you give to them. You can make the fougas, you can make the pisaladier, you can make many other things. And let's have a look right now at the ingredients. Phoebe! <sighs> so let's have a look now at the ingredients that you need to make that bread dough. You need 300 grams of white flour. You need 180 grams of cold water that you have put 30 minutes in the fridge before starting the recipe. You need uh, olive oil. You need some instant dry yeast. It's not the yeast you use to bake cakes. You will need a small teaspoon of dry yeast. You will need some uh, salt, I use sea salt. You need a salad bowl, a food processor with the hook attachment. You need a, a tea towel the size of the salad bowl. Make sure that you can cover it. Pour the dry ingredients first. Uh, put the flour into the food processor bowl. Then add your teaspoon of dry yeast on one side of the bowl. Then add one and a half teaspoon of salt on the other side of the bowl. Don't make the salt touch the yeast. Then pour your two tablespoons of olive oil. and simply add your cold water. So fix your food processor bowl into the food processor. Attach the hook attachment. and start to mix at speed one for four minutes. Then after the four minutes, adjust the speed to two and mix for six minutes. So in total is 10 minutes of mixing. After 10 minutes of beating, your dough is ready, so you can stop the food processor and separate the dough from the hook. You can see that the dough has developed elasticity, but then we're going to do a process that's going to develop more elasticity. Take your salad bowl and oil your hands and oil the salad bowl generously because you are going to put your dough in the bowl overnight in the fridge and you don't want it to stick when you will remove it. Use your food scraper to remove the dough. If you don't have a food scraper, you can do it with something else, but the food scraper is quite useful. 
slightly roll the dough into a round shape then take your tea towel and then wet it under the sink water very well it has to be very wet but not like dripping wet and cover your salad bowl with the dough inside and uh, put it in the fridge overnight so overnight it's at least eight hours after a night in the fridge your dough has risen and it has doubled in size at low temperature the fridge temperature should be around three degrees celsius flour gently your working station then take your dough scraper and pour your dough into the flour flatten it gently with the palm of your hand turn it to make sure that it doesn't stick and then you can slightly stretch the end like I do to turn into a bowl and at this stage your dough is ready to use here is an example of how I use the dough to make a pisaladière or to make a fougas that are the few usages of bread dough in Provence cuisine thank you for watching this video I hope you liked it so if you want to follow me on Instagram you can add me at myveganprovence and if you like this channel please subscribe and click the notification button to be notified when I will post the next recipes. Until next recipe, bye bye!